Hey YouTube, today I'm going to be reviewing the Bratz Sasha Fashion Doll I bought in town. Um, I don't know, because I've thrown away the packaging now, so I can't remember what generation or type of fashion doll, or what the name, because they do different, like, you know, things, like neon lights and different stuff. I don't know which one this is, it's definitely not this, but I guess that's one I can remember. I'm having and it's yeah like yeah and I've done her hair in this really cool sort of frizzy afro thing she's beautiful ethnically coloured she's lovely sort of Hispanic colour I wouldn't say she's black like she is in the movie she's a little bit lighter than the actress who plays her in the movie but she's still coloured, she's not white. And um, and she's really pretty, and she has lovely lips and lovely big brown eyes. And brown, it looks black in the light, but it's not. Lovely brown hair. And she's wearing a little pink top with a camouflage um, little dress, which is a little short, in my opinion, but I think it looks very nice. And her shoes which are not actual shoes she doesn't have feet if you take the shoes off they do come off they're not sculpted in hang on oh gosh they come off like that like a normal shoe but ah! she doesn't have feet so her feet kind of click into the shoe into a hole inside the shoe so you push it back on and it clicks right in right into the hole and another compatible feature is that you can stick human earrings so here's an earring they've got little holes in their ears and you can put human earrings in their holes so they can wear your earrings the earring holes are long enough for a proper actual person earring to fit all the way in and fit snugly on their ear. You don't have to make, you don't have to push it further into the plastic or anything. It's perfect, the hole is just big enough for an actual earring. So you can put your earrings on the dolls and which I think is a feature they've always had. Maybe wrong, but I think it's a feature they've always had. And fully like stylable synthetic hair, it's not molded, it's hair. I, I was gonna say actual hair, but it's not it's synthetic, but you know what I mean. It's hair, not like plastic. And her hands, quite chubby little fingers. They're not really skinny like the Barbie dolls. Still quite, but you know, they're more realistic hands, I think, than the Barbie dolls. And she's really cute. And I will be making clothes for her and her other friends who I'm going to buy soon. And still need to buy Chloe, Yasmin, and Jade. Who I'm going to buy when I get my allowance, hopefully not all three of them, because they're like four ninety. They're like five quid each. I suppose I could afford all three of them actually. Yeah, they're five quid each, and I get fifteen pound a month, so I could afford all three of them. But I, th I don't think I'm going to buy all three of them in November. I um, I think I'm going to buy like maybe one or two, probably two. Or maybe just one, I don't know. But I think I'm going to buy all three of them. Because I want to have, like, a little bit of money to spend on other things as well. But she's super gorgeous. And she can't wait for her friends to join her here in my room. And in my life. And I will hopefully will be making brat story videos. So they'll go on little adventures and I'll video it. And put it on like people do it with ponies and stuff. I'll be making little stories with them and I am going to upload more loom bracelet tutorials sooner or later if I can I'm not going to show you my face in this video because I haven't made up I haven't done my hair or nothing so I don't look great so I'm probably not going to do that but she's really cute and she can't wait for her friends to join her so thank you for watching me I'm Ruben Lover 9 7 comment rate and subscribe